Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a pretty little thing haul for you guys, which I am very excited about because backstory, you guys know, I love my pretty little thing loungewear so much. I've been wearing the stuff to death to the point where I was like, I need some kind of like, these are now like in the realm of, I wouldn't wear these out the house. I've like dropped multiple things on them. I have stained them. You guys know I love the gray trackies. So they are looking a little bit worse for wear because I am clumsy. Oh, yeah. My point is I had a pretty little thing wish list stacking up of all of these things that I wanted to pick up. And then pretty little thing asked me if they could sponsor a video. And if that's not manifesting, I don't know what is. Just kidding. But thank you so much to Pretty Little Thing for sponsoring this video because it has made me a very, very, very happy girl. So I'm going to show you guys my order. We're going to try it on together. I'm going to show you how I style things. There's a lot of comfy stuff in here, but also a few other bits as well, because although Pretty Little Thing is so so good for loungewear and so good for basics that's not actually the only thing that they do well i love their swimwear i love their accessories i love their dresses you guys know i love their cardigan as well so just in case anybody needed to know this this is my fave long ribbed gray cardigan from pretty little thing i started wearing it at the start of lockdown you guys all went nuts for it it sold out it's back so for all of you guys that loved it and i know that you were really sad that you missed out on it it's now back in stock so go forth my friends so there are quite a few bits for me to show you some bought by myself but disclaimer the majority of what is in this package here it's gifted so i thought i'd take you through what i'm wearing firstly this is actually a body from pretty little thing i love the color of this it's like a gorgeous like gray minky color i love it i'm also wearing a pair of their gray jogging bottoms which actually come in a set in a duo which i couldn't not pick up so this is the body just so you can see it on these aren't actually the tracky bottoms that i planned on pairing it with i actually ordered these in a dark gray so this but basically a bit more cool toned and a little bit darker and i thought they would work super well together i ordered the wrong gray which is so annoying but it's fine i'm gonna order them again and i think this would work so well with a dark gray that has kind of like a blue tone to it to match the cool tones in this as well. I think it would work so nicely. So very excited to finally get that look together. Yeah, this is so comfy and I actually think it's super flattering and it's a little bit more dressy as well. So you could dress it up, but for me, it's going to just like glam up my trackies that little bit more. Love this. And it also has a kind of like thong bum as well. So you don't get any like VPL and I'm a fan. I'm such a fan. And this is what the grey pair of trackies from the set looks like. I love this tone of grey. I think it's a bit like white where it just helps to make you look really, really tanned. And it's just really brightening and I love, I love it. These and the casual joggers from PLT have been my go-to grey jogging bottoms for years. If you have been watching my channel for a long time, you will know I love them. And I can't fault the petite ones. They are so great. I just love the fact that I don't have to roll them up at all i picked these up last week and they basically come in a two pack and they're great value for money so i picked those up because i'm desperately oh i think these came in petite which is why i was so excited about them because basically it's just really hard for me to find good tracky bottoms that are like the right length for me and pretty little thing always come through so these are the black petite tracky bottoms from the duo set they fit my leg length so well that i will overlook the fact that they don't have a drawstring and pockets because i don't care because they actually fit my leg length. This is so rare. They are not rolled up at all. So happy. So happy. I actually have a sage set, which loads of you have asked about on Instagram. I will pop it. There's a little video I posted on Instagram. I'll put it on screen here. I love this set. Like, I love it so much. It's currently in the wash at the moment, which is why I'm not wearing it, because I would be wearing it in this main chatty bit now. But it's in the wash because I dropped my dinner down it last night. Seems to be a running theme of me dropping my dinner down things at the moment. In addition to my classic grey and black tracky bottom purchases, I also picked up this pair. This is so cute. It's in this beautiful nudie colour and I love wearing like tracksuits and bodies and I really like, obviously, as I kind of have already said, I really like if they match. So basically, I have a lot of tracky bottoms at the moment because I have so many like different bodies that I want to wear them with and I'm just so excited to mix and match them all up. So I have... A tan pair as well. This is the most gorgeous tone of tan. I am obsessed. So I'll show you what those look like on now. <sighs> I just love trackies. They make me so happy. So these are the nudie pink coloured trackies. I really like these. I love the hem on them. It's slightly different to some of the other pairs I have. So it's like cuffed rather than elasticated. I think that's the words that you use. So it kind of can sit a little bit higher up on your leg, but without you having to roll it up. And I think that it looks so nice, so flattering. It's got pockets. 
which I love. I definitely have about 72 bajillion different tops in this color as well, which I'm so excited about because you guys know I love having a one color all over. So yeah, these are super cute, super comfy, so soft, so soft. These might be one of my favorite tracky bottom sets from this haul. And yeah, I've just paired them with the same body that I'm wearing in the main part of this video. I feel like this just goes really well with all tracky bottoms. Honestly, I don't know what it is. Since I've had my hair cut, all I want to wear are trackies and bodies, and it's just like, I feel like it's such a vibe. So that is basically the base of my summer to autumn transitional dressing. That's what I'm in day to day when I'm working, and I absolutely love it. I forgot I also picked up a white pair, which I'm so excited about because I love my white bodies and i'm gonna absolutely love wearing these trackies with my white bodies they're like a proper white white as well i find it so hard at the moment to find anywhere that does like an actual white everything seems to be a cream and i just find it just doesn't look great with my skin tone like my skin tone looks very very good with like a real white kind of white so these are the white trackies i love these they are perfect fit i'm so glad i got the petite i literally have nothing to say about them other than the fact that they are perfect i'm so happy with them it's just so so nice when you buy a pair of trackies and their leg length the leg length is good so i would probably style these with either like a nude body or a white body gray kind of keep it in the like soft light kind of neutral toned palette nothing too dark because i think it's then a bit too much of a contrast between the top and the bottoms and one of the reasons i really love pairing like similar colors together is because it actually helps to elongate your figure and make you look taller it kind of gives that like optical illusion so that is one of the reasons why you will often see me and probably so many other people in um, the same color top and bottoms because it actually just helps to elongate your figure rather than like cutting you off in the middle. Some of these I got in petite, I will mark in the info box, everything would be linked in the info box by the way, as per always, you guys know, but I will mark in the info box which of these I bought in petite because obviously being five foot two, I'm slightly vertically challenged and it's just nice to be able to find things in petite and that is something that I do think Pretty Little Thing do so well. But yeah, those are my things that I picked up, so let's get into the main thing. <laughs> I'm so excited about these. So I have to angle my eyes very carefully because I feel like you can see all of my hair products on my windowsill. But I love these sunnies. These are basically a really good dupe for my Givenchy aviators. But they're basically in a tan, kind of slightly see-through lens and I just think they are so cool. I love an aviator style shade. I just think that they are so cool. They suit my face shape quite well, I think, especially, well, especially only, only if they are oversized. If they're like that kind of like small style aviator, I look terrible, but an oversized, to be honest, any oversized sunglasses, but an oversized aviator, I just love. And I feel like the sheer kind of tan is very, very in right now. And also shades that aren't like completely opaque are great for winter because you don't need like a dark, dark pair of shades. I love these, I think they are so cool. I always feel like Pretty Little Thing are one of the quickest brands to turn around, specifically like sunglasses. They're always so, on it with their sunglasses when they launch new sunglasses they're always like something that i have been looking for and no one else has been doing so yeah would highly recommend for sunglasses i also picked up this sunglasses chain you guys will know if you watched my haul that i uploaded last week i love sunglasses chains and i love finding new ones so i picked up this i really like the fact that it's like really chunky and statement at the front and then not so statement over the rest of the chain. I think it's really cool. You can either have them like right at the front of the shades and have it like really here, or you can kind of like slide it a bit further back and it's just a bit more subtle. I really love it. I don't know if this is like the perfect pair of shades for this to be shown on as an example, but I think on like something a bit more simple, like my Ray-Bans, that would look so, so cool. I just love my sunglasses chains. I'm obsessed with them. I also picked up this really simple little grey ribbed top. I thought this would be a perfect basic going into the autumn months. It'd be really, really nice with jeans. A pair of tailored trousers, trackies, like pretty much everything. And this is what the gray top looks like on. I really like the scoop neck that it has to it and it actually fits really well. I thought it was gonna be a little bit baggy, but it fits really nicely. It tucked really well into my black trackies. Very, very happy with this one. It's just a really great wardrobe essential. I am obsessed with Pretty Little Thing for like the tones that they do like this. 
I just love this and I find that it's so rare that other brands like really nail like the color range. It's one of my favorite things when a brand does like repeats of so many items but just in varying colors and really really great colors as well that is so hard to find. Like my Sage loungewear set, I haven't been able to find anything like that anywhere and I just love it. Like the tone of it is perfect. So yeah, they really nail it with their tones but also just with their basics in general. I got a little white long sleeved ribbed top. I actually tried one that I got at the start of lockdown and it was so big on me, so, so big on me. So I'm hoping this one is like a little bit more of a slim fit. It kind of looks it. So I got this in a size, I'll pop all the sizes in the info box by the way guys, cause I know sometimes I forget to say. I got this in a size 10 and hopefully it's a little bit more fitted. If not, I will get a size eight because I just really want something nice and simple that is really, really fitted, but something with a little bit of a longer sleeve for the autumn months, so hopefully that fits. So this is the basic white sweatshirt, I love it. It's a really good fit. I could have actually gone a size smaller, I think, if I wanted it really, really fitted. The sleeves are a little bit longer than average, which I really like. It just gives that kind of cozy feeling to it. Yeah, I think it looks great with the white trackies. What also looks so great with a pair of black trackies or gray trackies as well. I definitely see myself pairing this with like non color items more. Yeah, let me know what you think. Should I get it in a size down or do we think this fit? is okay it's also not too see-through as well which i really like you can kind of see the indents of my bra here but you can't actually see like the color coming through or anything like that which i don't think to my eye i haven't seen anything um and i think that's really great as well so yeah let me know on the sizing but i think this is such a great basic to have in your wardrobe it would look so cute like high-waisted mom jeans and a brown belt in the autumn even with like denim shorts in the summer on like those cooler summer days for some of you that could even be a cooler spring day depending on where you live but yeah they're just like one of the perfect like basic essentials to have in your wardrobe even if you're like running to and from the gym i feel like this is a great piece to have in your wardrobe also white always makes my makeup look better and my body and face look more tan so it is always always a winner for me i'm really off with my sizing at the moment so um bear with me whilst i adjust to having to buy a different size for myself i know some of you have said it in the comments already but it's getting to the point where it's like starting to annoy me now anyway i also picked up this little cord which i just love i've been looking for something like this for a while so we have the kind of like loungewear bottoms they're in like a fitted style so they're kind of like a legging but they're not a legging if that makes sense so they've got a cuff hem at the bottom and they're in a lovely rib in this beautiful oatmeal color. I can't wait to try this on. I actually already have this in like a sagey color because I've been shopping a lot recently, but I just loved the oatmeal so much. And I actually think that it's a lot more flattering on my skin tone. So, so excited to try this on. I got it in a medium. It does run slightly small, I find. So I got both the top and the bottoms, I believe in a medium, just for extra added comfiness. Like the small was fine, but just like a little bit small on my head. Maybe I have a large head. Who knows? How do you know? how do you find that out? Do you get a tape measure? Right, what do you do? So this is the little oatmeal rib set. I love this. I'm so glad I went for it in the sides up because my sage set definitely was a bit more of a squeeze getting over my head, but this was absolutely fine. And I actually really like the leggings in the sides up as well. They are so cute. I think the fit of this is so nice, so comfy, so, don't drink every time I say so. It's just such a gorgeous colour. I'm in love with this set. I have nothing else to say. It's perfect. It would be a me video at the moment if I didn't pick up a midi dress. I picked up this white, kind of like, it's like a creamy colour, I want to say. Yeah, cream cotton sleeveless twist waist midi dress in a size 10. I'm hoping that the size is good because that will make me so happy because I love a midi dress. And I think this colour and fit would work really, really well on me. I'm so excited to try it on. So this is the white midi. This is so cute. Maybe a tiny bit see-through, but honestly, it's only really a problem for me because I have tattoos. You can kind of see them through the sides. This would look so, so lovely with like a long trench coat or like a denim jacket, maybe like a leather jacket in the right kind of tones. I've just kind of popped it on with a pair of sliders, but it's super cute. It fits really well. I feel like I've got a good size. I feel like this could be so great with a trench. What do we think? Let me know. I think it's cute. I just love, I love a white dress. You guys know. Oh my God, you guys, these two. These look like the perfect pairing. So cute, like so perfect for when you're just like lounging around the house, but you want to look cute. And you know what I love as well? I love 
this slit up the back that you get it just makes it like slightly easier to move in so comfy i also like this twist detail on the side i feel like you could kind of ruch this up a little bit and it would help to disguise the food baby which is very very important to me this kind of thing is perfect over like the summer to autumn transitional period because you can kind of throw it on with like a trench coat or a leather jacket for me it's got to be like a trench coat or a coat again because you guys know i love that vibe i actually have a trench coat in this little package here but i've also actually just got a lot of my like coat and stuff out of the loft and i'm so so excited to wear them with all of my like slouchy kind of lounge wear but also with like midi dresses and things like that it just works so perfectly okay let's talk about the trench coat whilst i'm here this is the cutest colour. It's like a light warm beigey tone, which is like my favourite tone. I hate it when you get trench coats that are like a beigey tone, but they're like a yellow. That does not look good on me. It kind of works if I have darker hair, but if you have any kind of lightness or blonde to your hair, you want like the perfect tone to your trench coat, because otherwise it just looks so off and it makes your hair look so yellow and it's just not cute so i'm hoping the length of this will be good if not it's not the end of the world because as we know with a lot of my coats i have ones that are like wear with boots kind of coats where it's like i have to be wearing a heel in order for this to kind of work for me but we might be okay we'll see we'll see i got this in a size eight and this is the stone oversized trench coat so with coats i would normally get my regular size if i want an oversized kind of feel but i kind of opted to size down with this one but because it is oversized and i just don't want to be like too swamped trenches always do tend to be a little bit oversized on me anyway so this is the kind of beigey creamy trench coat this is so so gorgeous it is a little bit long on me i'm gonna see if they have it in petite because i need this in my life it is so so cute i love trenches and i always feel like they work really really well if you're wearing something more casual because they are very smart and it almost helps to dress up something a bit more casual especially something like trackies i just think it works really really well you can wear them with trainers or a pair of sliders if it's a little bit warmer yeah, so lovely it's got nice big pockets tie waist so cute so cute and like I said in the main part of the video, I just love the colour of this. It's that kind of traditional trenchy colour, but it's not too yellowy. I also picked up these trousers. I love the colour of these. Oh my god, that tone. Oh, I just love it. I just love it so much. Like, why can't everything be in this colour? Like, oh, I just feel like whenever I wear this tone, my makeup always works so well with it. I guess because it's like the same kind of tone that a lot of my makeup kind of is in like i feel like it really matches my eyeshadow does this look weird do i look crazy it is going to need a little bit of a steam but that is absolutely fine these are so cute i think they have pockets oh yes they have pockets a nice elasticated waist these are like the perfect going out for dinner kind of trouser because they have the elasticated waist it can stretch it can accommodate your food i love it and hopefully i feel like the leg length looks pretty good on these i don't think oh i got them in petite well done me so these are called the petite camel casual trousers and i got them in a size 10. they have a little drawstring waist so it kind of made sense for me to get a 10 even if they're like slightly big i can always bring them in which is perfect and then i have a little bit more material around my bum and legs which i always just find a little bit more flattering anyway. these trousers are such a gorgeous color and they're a slightly smarter alternative to the tracky bottoms that you will have seen throughout this haul i actually have these in black as well and i love them i love a kind of tailored trouser but this is lovely because these are a lot more flowy, a lot more casual. They work really beautifully whether you're shorter or taller. They kind of have that more cropped effect if you are taller and not so much if you are smaller. And the elasticated waistband and tie waist really allows you to kind of tailor the trousers to your figure, which I just always find is obviously the most flattering. And it just works so, so well. There's nothing worse than when you try on trousers and they're not adjustable around the waist and they just don't sit right. You always have them sitting right if you've got a pair of trousers that have the elasticated kind of tie waist. So yeah, these are definitely something you can dress up or dress down. They would look so cute with a pair of trainers, but equally cute with a nice top and a pair of heels as well. I feel like pairing them with this body is slightly off because it's definitely making them look a lot more pink than they are, but they are the most lovely kind of like beigey toned trousers and I really, really love them. Next up, we have a couple of loungewear pieces, like proper, true loungewear pieces. I feel like I can really get away with wearing my trackies outside of the house, but when it comes to like knitted things, I don't know. I reserve them for being at home and being very comfy. But this is a knitted cream loungewear set. So we've got like a fitted jogger style kind of bottom with an elasticated waist. And then we have the top. I got these in a size small. The top is so cute. It's like a v-neck kind of top. Oh, this is going to be so cute. 
Yay. I'm very excited to try those on. Hopefully they look good. So this is the knitted set. I have to say this is probably one of the sets in this haul that I would go for a size up in. Purely to get a little bit more coverage around my boobs. It kind of fits, it fits like bang on but I personally would just like a little bit more length to this and just maybe a little bit more of a high-waisted fit to the bottoms as well this is hitting at a good point but i would have just preferred like ever so slightly higher but the leg length on this is great i was actually so surprised like this is like the perfect point and i feel like even if you're taller then it's just kind of more meant to be like a crop whereas on me it's like full legging length i really like the back of this though the cut is really lovely but yeah i would have just preferred a little bit more length to the top because it's currently cutting in right underneath my boobs and i feel like i feel like my top half is like boobs so yeah i would definitely size up if you do like a little bit more room for your boobs or just a little bit more material this set does just run slightly small but it's very very cute now i also picked up this set which is like a larger knit the cream set is more of a fine knit and the top is obviously a lot smaller the top on this one is a little bit longer you could kind of get away with wearing this like in front of people i love this it's so cute and that gray color is like the perfect gray it's like a really lovely cool toned gray color it feels so soft i got these in a size small and then it comes with the matching bottoms as well oh these feel so soft these might be a little bit long on me we'll see how we go but i couldn't resist not trying these oh they feel so nice they feel so great so if we could all pray that they fit my tiny little legs that would be great. This is the cutest set. The bottoms are sadly a little bit too long for me, which is a bit annoying, but I'm gonna see if it comes in a petite because this is so cute. The knit is super soft, super comfy. You can actually, because it's like tighter at the hem, you could roll it under if your body is a bit more vertically challenged like mine is, or if you are taller, you can pull it down tuck it in i can't get over how soft it is it feels so nice what do we think guys do i see if they have it in petite or do i need it let me know finally finally there's a bit of color i know what was i thinking i picked up this really cute little workout set just for when i am working out at home and just doing little bits on my mat where i don't need anything like super super supportive so i got this in a size small medium and it comes as a two set so the bottoms are the same size as well but they're this gorgeous like greeny color i'm really loving that at the moment it's really cute and i've always felt like my workout wardrobe is a nice way to incorporate color into my life without taking it like too seriously and without like worrying too much my workout wardrobe tends to be quite neutral as a whole but then there's also like pops of pink and lilac in there and fun prints and patterns as well so i think these make a really nice addition to that collection so this is the little mint set on i love this the top fits so so well and the cut of it is so flattering i really really love this cut lots of you will have seen me wear things like this in this shape a lot before i think it's a really really flattering cut and the bottoms are great though i would say that i could maybe do with the size down because i don't feel like i feel these enough we've got like a little bit of excess here and then if I pull the cycle shorts all the way down to where they're meant to be they're kind of like a little bit too baggy on me so I think I just don't fit this size so I could probably do with the size down in these I've just kind of like ruched them up it could actually be my height more than my size because I feel like when I ruched them up they kind of hit the point where the majority of my other cycle shorts do so if you are taller i would say these could be an amazing option because they're actually a little bit longer in the length than the majority of cycle shorts i own anyway so definitely a great set to look at and i believe they do this in a couple of colors as well so yeah check them out this is so cute it's like the cutest set i love it this would be such a nice addition to my workout wardrobe so cute so that is it for my pretty little thing haul let me know what your favorites were in the comments below if you're new to my channel please subscribe and if you want to go over to the pretty little thing youtube channel and subscribe as well i will leave a link in the info box and as always links to everything that i've shown will be in the info box below as well thank you all so much for watching i hope you've all enjoyed it and i'll see you guys again very very soon bye